Hello and welcome to the Rule 20 video. Rule 20 is an application video and kicks off the section for lights and shapes. So get your notepad ready and let's begin. Rule 20A states that the rules in this part shall be complied with in all weathers. So what this is simply stating is that the rules in this next section, which we're going to cover, which is the lights and shapes section, apply to all conditions of weather. To make it a little bit easier for you, just think that all of the rules that we're going to cover in the lights and shapes section apply any time that you're navigating. Rule 20B states that the rules concerning lights shall be complied with from sunset to sunrise and during such times no other lights shall be exhibited except such lights as cannot be mistaken for the lights specified in these rules or do not impair their visibility or distinctive character or interfere with the keeping of a proper lookout. So what this is simply stating is that during the times from sunset to sunrise you cannot have any of the lights that would confuse other vessels as to your navigation lights. The second part of the rule is stating that the lights that you do have on your vessel cannot interfere with the lookout's responsibility and their ability to be able to see. So for example, when you're navigating at night, you wouldn't navigate with bright lights on inside of your pilot house because that's going to create a backscatter of lights within your vessel that's going to impede your vision to be able to see. Whenever I'm navigating at night, we have a center console fishing boat. We always dim the electronics and turn off all the lights under the console to ensure that it does not impair my vision. Rule 20C states that the lights prescribed by these rules shall if carried, also be exhibited from sunrise to sunset in restricted visibility and may be exhibited in all other circumstances when deemed necessary. So this is just simply stating that sometimes when you're in restricted visibility during the daytime, you'll also have to have your navigation lights on. So for example, if you're navigating and you find yourself in a rain or heavy thunderstorm or in a fog situation or any other condition where visibility is restricted, you will need to turn on your navigation lights. And this ensures that other vessels that are also navigating within that restricted visibility will have an easier time identifying your vessel. Rule 20D states that the rules concerning shapes shall be complied with by day. So what this is just simply stating is that when we get into this section, we're going to cover all of the lights that the vessels have to display along with the day shapes. And the day shape is shapes that the vessels will display, which correspond to the lights that they will also show. The rule is just simply stating that these are only to be displayed during daylight hours. And this is because the day shapes don't have any illumination at all. So if you were to have them up at night, it's not going to do you any good because other vessels won't be able to identify them and see them. Rule 20E states that the lights and shapes specified in these rules shall comply with the provisions of Annex 1 to these regulations. So what this is simply stating is that all of the rules that we're going to cover now in the lights and shapes section have to comply with Annex 1. And Annex 1 is a section which we're going to cover later, but it, it specifically focuses on the location and placement of the lights and the day shapes. So this is just to ensure that there's consistency between all the vessels. So no matter the construction and the shape of the vessel, that these lights and day shapes can easily be identified. So congratulations for completing the application rule for the light and shape section. Now this section is a very important section, so you really wanna make sure that you fully understand each of the rules that we're gonna cover before you move on to the next video. So get your notepad ready, organize your notes, and I'll be waiting for you in the next video.